The desert that backs the shore gives some protection, but the coast has its hunters, on the lookout for the weak and defenseless. A jackal. Mothers won't come back until they have fed. The youngsters must fend for themselves. Seals have been breeding here for thousands of years. In the distant past, this was an island. But over the centuries, sand swept north by the Benguela current joined it to the mainland. So now, the jackals have the run of the colony. The jackal gives a pup an exploratory nip to see how strong it is. A solitary jackal prefers the weak or sick. serious threat arrives, a brown hyena. The hyena is much larger than the jackal and will take healthy pups. Seals can see well underwater, but on land, they're very short-sighted. If something keeps still, they will approach it. Perhaps there's safety in numbers, and jackals are more scavengers than killers. A jackal's best chance for a taste of seal meat is to shadow a prowling hyena. For most of the year, hyenas scavenge a meager living in the desert. But for just a few weeks, when the seals are breeding, the supply of food seems almost unlimited. The hyena scouts for the best opportunity. It's looking for a sleeping or unattended pup. A mother seal could drive the hyena off. A pup on its own stands no chance. colony, death is a fact of life. A fifth of pups won't survive their first month, many dying from heat stress. With so many pups around, the hyena will eat only the best parts of each kill, leaving the jackals to squabble over what's left. <laughs> <laughs> 